you know, I think I go back to you need to see it to be it. I think we are creating a uh, great uh, system where um, this government has has uh, put forward the very first women's entrepreneurship strategy. It's the first ever of its kind. It's a $2 billion investment to double the number of female entrepreneurs by 2025. And it is ambitious, but it is absolutely achievable. There are only 16% of companies in our in Canada that are women-led or women-owned. We can do a lot better than this, considering that 99% of our businesses are small and medium-sized businesses, and yet, McKinsey Institute tells us that we can add up to $150 billion to the Canadian economy by 2026 just simply by adding women to the Canadian economy. So we have an ambitious plan to double the number of female entrepreneurs. We're, we've got an investment of $2 billion to support that effort and I know we're going to be able to reach this goal because when women succeed, we're going to all succeed, but women do need to see leaders in the field of finance, in the field of venture capital. It is why this government has put $450 million in venture capital funding out into uh, the marketplace that is allowing for the private sector to raise more capital to f invest in our Canadian entrepreneurs. And some of those uh, funds that we have put out there require that the leadership of some of those funds are going to be women leadership. There's a requirement for some of those funds to make investments and investments in female-owned or female-led corporations. So seeing it to be it is what we aim to do.